Greetings everyone and welcome back, this is Marco and today we're taking a look at the Canon FD 70-210mm f4. The lens is made out of metal and hard plastic. It weighs around 620 grams, it is 152 to 166 millimeters long, it has an external diameter of 72 millimeters with a 58 millimeters front thread. The front element turns when focusing. The iris has 8 blades, the aperture is clicked and it goes from f4 to f4. 32 with half steps plus auto. The focusing ring is textured, it turns 160 degrees, and minimum focusing distance is 1.2 meters. At 70 millimeters, it can enter macro mode and focus up to 45 centimeters. The Canon FD mount has a flange distance of 42 millimeters. As you all know, I do not like the sliding barrel focus and zoom system, but this specific lens has just the right amount of resistance. Sharpness wide open is alright, but not amazing, with slightly softer corners and some noticeable vignetting. Stopping down to f8 it gets very sharp in the center, but less in the corners. Chromatic aberration is present wide open in high contrast areas, but it disappears stopping down. Colors, contrast and saturation are in line with the other Canon FD lenses. Specular highlights go from very big and soft to smaller with hard edges, according to the focal length and distance from the subject. Normal use, it didn't have any issues with flares and ghosting, but shining a light straight into the lens does produce some flare. And now, some samples. As always, it is hard to find great vintage zooms, but this Canon is pretty good. Sure, it's not perfect, but perfection is not what we look for in a vintage lens. I have two complaints about it, and you already know the first one, the sliding barrel and focus system. I just don't like it. The second is weight and size. It is just a bit too big, heavy and cumbersome for my arthrosis to deal with. But both of those are just my personal problems, and overall I would say it is a good, cheap vintage zoom. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments down below, 
Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!